Welcome to Risk Live. I'm a grandmaster at this game, hoping to share some tips and tricks to help you get better. Let's have some fun out here, too. We are playing Classic Caps Fixed, I believe. Classic Fixed. We have no fog, no blizzards. Um, this is not a ranked game. And we are going to be in the fourth position. So we're just going to have some fun with this one. See how it goes. Need to get some practice in these uh, other maps. A lot of... Uh, we're not going to be playing Caps games in the tournaments, but we will be playing these maps in the tournaments coming up. So I need to get a feel for them again. I haven't played them for a little while. This just looked like a might be a fun game to try. So it looks like we've got a spot to cap here in North America. Might even take this cap spot. Because nobody's going to cap here. going after us pink and purple if we go here it's a harder card block later on in the game red already went did not go here purple could end up going here well we're, we're gonna leave that to purple I think purple's gonna get that one uh, what do we have that's probably our best bet, one of these two. I guess we could go over here, too. Hmm. Does black try and roll us? No, probably not. Let's take the five anyways, I think. <laughs> We're going to take the five. Just to be safe. This is fixed, so I'm not too concerned. We definitely want a cap that's going to block off a bonus if we can get it. Wow, purple chose down here instead of up here. I guess they would have had to worry about red potentially trying to roll their cap. But no, it was a one either way. What a weird choice. What a weird choice. And we've got a five right next to him. We could try and roll purple's cap on turn one. What do we start with? Six? Eleven on four? Red's going to be in a position to uh, take it if we don't get a good roll. But I think it's probably worthwhile to go for it. Orange must have bought it. Yes. What the heck? Red's going to take that cap. Yeah, maybe not. It's got to be attractive, though. But he's going to have to try and hold two caps, and Black's got a six right next to him. Purple's nowhere near us, so we're definitely going to try for this cap. Might as well. We can always attack this one if we need to, if we're unsuccessful. When you go last in the turn order, you don't cap on a one, and you definitely don't cap near territories that have <laughs> troops like that. Black? Are they going to take it on one? Two? Okay, that's risky. Let's see if pink lets them hold it. Black is over attacking. 
slow rolling it. Weird. Didn't even matter if he would have got that. He's still gonna need to fortify from here onto his cap. Ninety-five percent. Got it. Good roll. We'll take it. Should be able to clear red out of that pocket. And we have orange to protect us a little bit. Orange might even help us. Orange may end up adding troops here and taking that. Not surprising. And Pink didn't want them to keep that bonus. That's helpful for us. A lot of material up here in North America to get through, so we're not going to be too concerned about doing that too quick. We'll just take uh, Australia first. Pink's in a good position. Strong cap. He's got a lot of troops. Didn't overextend. Was able to attack and keep black from getting their bonus. They're going to battle here, though. That's going to weaken pink. Purple's not even close to me, and they bought it out now. So we're, we're going to have bots to deal with. But that should be fairly easy if we can get uh, red out of here. Red may focus on taking that cap now. Ooh. <laughs> I like that the bot keeps fortifying back to there. So in a fixed caps game, you definitely want to get bonuses. We've got to outpace our opponents. Trying to figure out what to do, or are they going to give up? Boy, why did he attack there? It's overextending. There's no reason to hit there. Oh my goodness. Okay. <laughs> I thought he was going to go off of that. He was going to lose that. We can hold that. Red's got quite a bit to get through if he wants to come through and attack our cap. I think I'm okay with a six stack here. I was going to say, I'm surprised if uh, Pink doesn't take that. He got hit hard, though. He lost a lot of troops there. He's going to have to pull this back. Stack it right there. Or this one up here. Interesting choice. 
Maybe he wants red to hit that. Or maybe he's afraid black would try and take this if he didn't go to this one. So let's hope orange doesn't try and break us here. Not a big deal if they do, just delay us a little bit. Black again, overextending. Dude's just blowing all of his troops. Pink is almost dead. Because they overextended. Trying to take that cap. They're going to likely catch up on the next turn. Are about to get traded in, so I gotta be careful. No trade. Working on getting a big trade at least. Either a artillery or a or the big one, one of each. What are you gonna do, Pink? You got some ones to attack. Are you giving up? Pink might have given up. So red's the only other one that hasn't over attacked. And if he gets a big trade here, he could do some damage. He could definitely come in here, wipe me out. Looks like Black's going to manage to keep his bonus. The way he overattacks, I'm not too worried about him.
Oh, and he traded in with a small trade. Oh, protecting his cap. Where's he going to get his card? Right here. Smartest thing he's done all game. doesn't trade in a big set and try and come in here we have a big trade excellent pink might come off of that cap one of those two if we get the opportunity to take one we do oh black out broke <laughs> oh all right he's hanging on there that's good pink still offline So we're going to keep an eye out for potential kills. Purple traded in. They're not going to be an attractive kill. Orange is protecting us from red at the moment. So I'm not too concerned about doing anything there with orange. So we'll just bide our time. Keep an eye on black. Black is probably going to be our prime target. And then purple. Because obviously we want North America for a bonus. We don't have to have North America. Having Australia, we're outpacing everybody. This is the cap we want right here. We want this one. Right there, Middle East.
the red finally take this? Nope. Fighting his time. We have another big trade. Lucky. This is going to be too easy if we keep getting all the big trades. Nice of pink not to abandon that cap. Orange is on four cards. We take the orange kill to progress the game. It's not really worth it. Basically, the trade's worth 10. Well, about 12. If you figure three per card, trade's worth about 12 at best. We've got to kill 22 troops to get it. I'm not going to worry about that. Red's blocked off to us now. So I don't have to worry about red coming in here. Although orange can open it up at any time. So could pink. I think pink wants Africa. Caps weak. Black could go for it. Red could come around. Take it. That's probably what I would do. Although he has to be able to withstand a 27. That might be difficult. Maybe purple takes it. No. 
What are these bots? Expert. Okay. Where does black attack? Is he gonna attack here? He's not putting up enough troops. <laughs> he's gonna attack a three on one. Oh, let the laugh he fails that. Oh, okay, he's got his trade. He he didn't add any more to that three on one. Uh, well, fortunate for him, he was successful. <laughs> Those are not a hundred percent roll. You want to put at least four troops there. I mean, four troops is 100% roll. I could take that pink cap right now, but I don't think we're going to. I'm going to make sure I have enough. I'm not giving this cap up. I could have come down, used a bunch of troops, and I would need enough to make sure that pink wouldn't be able to just take it back. Alright, does pink go breaky breaky? Yes. <laughs> Black may come over and take this cap now. Oh, Pink Family came off of that cap. He's going to pull these troops back. Oh, okay. Okay. Red's got a shot in here. It's pretty cheap. We've got a shot in there that's cheap, too. Where's that seven going? Yeah, I figured that was coming. So now's the time for red to take over one of these caps. And black may just take over the other cap. If red takes this one, black could come through and take that. Don't know if we will. Don't really have a sense. It seems that he's uh, calmed down a bit. From his over attacking. We've got a nice solid lead. Orange is on three cards. We could kill Orange. We could bring this 25 up and take that cap. But that's going to be. Send some over this way to kill this one for orange. And then down here. Yeah, red took it. Does he take both? He does not. If 
that's definitely going to make it easier for us to come down and take one of these cats. Because now I don't have to have such a such a big stack. So if black doesn't take this one, we come take. That means orange is just about dead, too. I think we kill orange at the same time. left myself enough <laughs> I almost didn't leave myself enough position now. Should really start to outpace these guys. And keep this bonus. I mean, red could try and interrupt. And it's going to weaken him quite a bit. Our caps are pretty strong. He might have a trade. We have a wild. So hopefully on the next turn, we'll have a uh, big set to trade in. I don't really have to worry about black. He's blocked here. And even if he puts in a big set, he's not going to be able to take that cap from us. So red should have taken this one of these caps earlier. He could have used those extra troops. He's still in second place. Since everybody else has been hitting each other, but... He's quite a ways behind me. Pink's on two cards. Red likely kills pink on the next turn. I think we'll set up a kill guard on pink. Right down here. Madagascar. So we'll leave a few troops right here. We got another dude. No big trade yet. <laughs> That's lame. Well, maybe if we get Pink's cards, we can get it.
What's gonna open Black's cap? Interesting choice. <laughs> Not sure why he did that. It's only two. I'm still getting nine just from the caps. And we're going to get the kill on pink. I'm going to go after my other cat. Or is he just taking territory? He's just taking territory. Cool. I'm cool with that. So we're going to do that. That goes that way. This comes off this way. <laughs> he was sitting on a big drain. We still have all dudes. That's hilarious. That cap's in trouble. That cap could be in trouble. It's going to be tempting for Red. He doesn't have a trade. So it's not a guaranteed 100% hit. But he could get it. We've got a 14 here. We could come back if he gets a bad roll. But we won't have any other stacks in a position to get him. So let's see if he comes this way again. Breaks our bonus. Or does he try and take our cap? Oh, it might be 100%. If he puts all of it there. Might be 100%. Yeah, he wants it. What's he going to do? How are you going to keep it? Yep, that's the smart thing. 15-15 is what he should do. All right, that's a problem for us. Mm. So he could have come over and taken this one. And I kind of wanted Australia still. Purple is on five cards. Could kill purple. Oh, we made a trade. Oh, we got our wild. Okay. Um, we could kill purple, or we could just take our cap back. We're going to have 34 on 15. We could take a different cap. No, that one's our best bet. 
Yeah, we're gonna do that. I'm not worried about purple. I am worried about red. Now red is really low on troops. We're in a great position. Black has a lot of troops now, though, too. He's almost got that extra troop bonus. We have an extra troop bonus at the moment. We're going to start taking some territory. Black hit us. Knock us under 12. set so black's big stack is um, can't get to us can't get to any of us so we're not worried about black at all not worried about black at all I'll have 17 if he gets a big trade 18 you start with 8 He'll start with eight if he keeps all of his territories. Red's not sure what to do or they are giving up. It would have been in a pretty good position if I hadn't been able to take that cap on that turn. They gave up, and they had a 10 trade, too. Always weird when people do that. You'd think they'd want to take their set, their big set, and just hammer somebody who bothers them. <laughs> but they don't do it. They give up. Black opting to take purple out of this area. That's interesting.
Well, this one's just about over. Next time purple's on three, we'll probably kill purple. Red should start to come off these caps. We're going to take those caps. Black is not going to be in a position to be able to come take the caps. Because he doesn't have any troops mobilized. He's going to have 16 troops here. To get through purple and try and snag a cap. Ooh, red. Does red come in and break me? Whew. I did not. The cap's still formidable, too. It's going to knock us under. Nope, didn't quite get us under 12. Interesting. Okay, he is activating some troops up there. Mm, look at the small trade. That's a bummer. Can't get it lucky all the time, though. So we are going to... I don't want purple to hit black here. I want to take purple out of this spot. Probably that spot. Ready to kill purple yet? But potentially on the next turn, although red may kill him, black might get a trade and be able to kill him. But what I didn't want was black's bigger stack activated so he could take a cap if red comes off that cap this way. That's what we were playing for right there. Purple dies on this next turn by somebody. It'll be us if we get the opportunity. Stay off cam. Oh, he's bringing some on. Alright, not too bad. So if black trades in, he could kill purple. If he doesn't trade in, we kill purple. He is not killing purple. He didn't put in on the right side to kill purple. So you're going to go after Australia. Might just be going for some territory. troops to get through if he wants to break my Australia. <laughs> he is trying to break it. That's hilarious. That's hilarious. Alright, so we're going to kill purple. And then we are going to block black coming over to this side. Mm. How do we want to do this? We're going to do it this way. Never trade.
Black card blocked. I'll have to come off of this cap to get a card. How much damage does red do to us? Red wants Australia. Or I mean Asia. Red wants Asia. Do it. Do it. Nice. <laughs> Failed. Red. Red didn't even break us. Excellent. We're going to get some good bonuses. Black's going to activate his stack. Maybe leave his cap vulnerable. Nope, he's going to be content for getting second place. We will wipe out red. Let's do that this way. Red has a trade, potentially. So you're gonna bot out. I hope not. I don't want that 64 stack coming into play. A couple more turns, I get rid of red. And then we can deal with black. Okay, he is still here. So red gets Europe on this turn. Hopefully steps off count. 
days off cap. <laughs> Is he gonna break me here? He's gonna move this 11 onto a cap. Well, one of these two caps will be ours. Maybe both. Looks like we get to get both of them. Excellent. Excellent. This is almost over. Black activates that 71, though. It's going to slow things down, because we're going to have to protect a cap. Should be card blocked. Well, the red might hit my 13 stack, actually. Especially if they trade in. My double tap in. Nice. And on this turn, red dies. trade but we won't need it we'll, we'll uh kill red first we should have a big trade we'll be able to stack up on black Terrible trades. Let's go here. Yeah, okay. black body. I think you just wanted to make sure he got uh, second place. That's all she wrote.
Oh, we don't get to see what their ranks are. Because it's not a ranked game. Unfortunate. 